All right, so today is day 10, 10 days before I go and audition for at least University of Maryland. Um, I'm gonna be tracking my progress and um, keeping you guys up to date because I know I'm gonna make this into one big vlog type thing. Um, but I want to show my adventures and then eventually show where I got accepted to. So um, I hope you guys enjoy. I'm gonna be recording a little bit of each day. Um, I recorded a little bit at work, but it was, it was nothing, as you see. Uh, so, <laughs> um, so I'm gonna try to keep track of the days and count down and make this into one big video. So, thanks for watching. <laughs> Alrighty, so good morning, or afternoon rather, because it is almost 1 p.m. Um, I slept in a little bit because I worked yesterday and today's my day off. So, today is day nine, nine days before I go and perform, um, or rather travel. And um, yeah, so today I should be able to practice all day. Uh, I'm kind of really excited for that because I haven't really had the chance to sit down and just practice all day. But I am going to be taking frequent breaks because that kind of works for me, just taking breaks in between each, uh, you know, each uh, little session. Um, so, I also got to make a pet smart run. Uh, if anybody knows me, I have a lot of animals. <laughs> but, um, so basically, um, I got two African dwarf frogs from there and one of them passed. So I need to go and either return it or maybe get another one. Um, so, well... We'll see. We'll see what happens today. Oh, another thing I need to do today. I need to actually go through my phone and uh, delete things I don't need, get rid of old memes that I don't need anymore, and just go through old pictures and stuff and either transfer them to my laptop or uh, just get rid of them because I have no room on my phone and I want to have room for when I travel and make videos and stuff. So we'll, we'll see what happens to that. So I'm practicing with my heels on, but I have I have uh, socks on too. I'm sad to announce that I've deleted all of my memes for context later. I needed space on my phone. I want to go home. All right, guys, it's uh, day eight. I didn't do much today, I just worked and uh, went out to dinner with my parents, but um, yeah, uh, I didn't really get to practice today, I did do a little bit of a warm up, I'm gonna get up early so I can uh, practice all day tomorrow, um, I do have some things I need to do tomorrow, but um, yeah, um, I might show which dress I'm gonna be wearing for my audition, I might be going and getting a new dress, so yeah, well, uh, I'll see you tomorrow. All right, good morning. It is day seven. Um, I didn't wake up this early <laughs> this morning. Um, I slept in until noon. Um, I was tired. I could not sleep last night for some reason. Um, but my mom got me some snacks, so I'm gonna go through and see what she got me. All right, so what we got here? We got some wrap snacks. These are like the best ever. Um, we got some, some, some Nutri-Grain Bites. Okay, cool. Got some. Some, ooh, spicy cashews. Okay, love that. Got some more Nutri-Grain bites. Okay, what else we got? We got a bear claw Danish. Oh, okay, it's a Dutch apple. Nice. And we got what else we got? The heck are these? Crispy fries. Oh, it's a weird Asian food. I, if you know, if you know me, I'm super into like Asian foods and stuff like that. So this is this is interesting. This should be good. I'm hoping this is good. Guys, look at my outfit. It is super cute today. I know this has nothing to do with me practicing and playing, but I look awesome. What are you doing? Alright, so I'm almost done with my day. 
um, I went shopping with my mom. Uh, she's been wanting to do that for a little bit. So um, I did that. Um, I'm gonna be going out to dinner tonight. Um, my dad's birthday is on Monday, so we're just kind of, you know, celebrating the weekend. Um, and then I should be able to come home and practice. So I'm really excited because, you know, one more week and then this is it. This is the this is the start of a new chapter in my life. I just I want to, you know, um, I want to go somewhere good. I want to I want to be great. All right, so I just got home. Uh, had a had a fun day out. Um, I am going to take a shower, and then I'm going to practice, and then do a full run. So, yeah. <laughs> Hey everybody, it is day six. Um, I don't have really anything going on today. Today is Super Bowl day for those of you who are into the Super Bowl. Happy Super Bowl. Um, I personally am not a football fan. Um, I've done marching band for eight years now and I despise football now <laughs> just because of the memories of uh, football or of marching band. Um, so yeah so today um i don't really have anything going on so i get to practice all day but i do have some things i need to you know uh do like clean up and you know stuff like that just because i haven't done that in a while um but yeah so it's gonna be a pretty exciting day i get to practice and uh then perform for my parents um this week sometime i'm gonna be performing for my work um i asked them to uh perform and they said yeah sure so well We'll see what goes on with that. Hey guys, it is day five, five days before I go and travel and do my auditions. Um, so I am right now currently preparing to do my performance for my parents. I didn't get to do it yesterday. Um, I just, I got busy and I had a lot of stuff to do. So I uh, didn't do much today, just worked, worked of course. Um, I gotta work tomorrow and Wednesday. So that's gonna be fun, yay. Uh, <laughs> But, um, after Wednesday, um, Thursday and Friday, I'll be getting ready to go. Um, Friday, I'll do another performance, like a full rep performance for my parents. Right now, I'm only doing part of it. Um, and then, yeah, and then Saturday we go. And, yeah, it's gonna be a nine-hour drive to Maryland. So, yeah, w wish me luck, and, yeah. Hey, guys. Day three. Three days before I go and travel. Um... I didn't get to perform for my parents yesterday. Um, I had a, you know, a kind of late day. Um, thought I was going to, but I ended up not. Um, so I'm gonna try to do that tonight. Um, I had kind of a rough day at work. It was, 
tense. It was very tense. Um, everything's all right, but though. No. Um, but yeah. So hopefully I'll get to perform today. All right, hey everybody. It is day one. One day before, uh, yeah, we go on travel. Uh, so uh, I've been bad. I haven't been practicing, but I think it's for the better because usually if I take a little break from something and then come back to it, I play it like 10 times better. So uh, I'm gonna practice tonight and then practice tomorrow morning before I leave. And then, uh, yeah, probably practice on Sunday and then a little bit Monday before my audition. So yeah, um, but yeah, I haven't been doing anything other than working. I had a couple days off here and now I'm off for a week and a half. So yeah, here we go. All right, so I'm leaving. <laughs> I'm leaving for Maryland. Um, yeah, so here, here we go. And good morning. I am in Maryland. Yay! <laughs> Made it safely. Um, nine hour drive. It was actually not that bad. Um, but yeah. So today I'm going to tour the campus of Maryland, uh, University of Maryland, and then I'm going to possibly go to DC. I've never been to DC, so it's really exciting today. Um, but yeah. I'll show you, show you guys, uh, what, what I'm doing today. Alright guys, so I just got back from University of Maryland. Beautiful campus by the way. Um, it was pretty, pretty nice. I uh, got to go around, got to see where I'm going to audition, um, got to go into the stamp building which is their kind of student union building. Um, ate there, got to saw my cousin. Um, yeah, it was a, overall a great uh, experience and yeah, we'll see what happens tomorrow with the audition. Um, now I'm just going to practice for the audition for the rest of the night and um, yeah, well, uh, tomorrow's the day. <laughs> um, I'm really excited. Um, I'm more excited than nervous. Um, I've performed in front of so many people so many times. I just kind of doesn't really face me anymore, but um, it is kind of a big deal. So yeah, we'll see. All right, so I'm trying to practice and not only am I 3,600 and something feet above sea level, so it's a little bit harder to breathe, um, but I also have to wear a mask. 
and I have to wear a modified mask. So I'm just playing through this little hole I made. And on top of that, I had to put it above my ponytail in order for it to stay. And <laughs> it, uh, I don't know, my uh, client is making weird noises because of the spit that's accumulating and I can't tell if that's just weather, if it's my mask, if it's the elevation or what. <laughs> so um, I'm trying my best here, but I mean, it doesn't sound half bad. Um, believe it or not, it's actually not as hard to breathe. I know I said it is hard to breathe, but I think it's just because of the mask. It's harder to breathe in a lot of air, but um, it feels a lot clearer to breathe. So I'm not really concerned about that. Maybe in New Mexico because it'll be a little bit drier. Um, but yeah, we'll see. <laughs> so this is my venture so far. Hey guys, it's me. Um, it is early in the morning, like really early. <laughs> uh, I slept fine last night. Um, I was a little nervous last night, but I kind of got over it. I just convinced myself that it's not that big of a deal because it isn't. It's not. It's not that big of a deal. It's just the audition. Um, yeah. Um, I hope you guys are doing well. <laughs> I don't know what to say, man. Um, yeah, this audition's gonna be fun. Uh, it's gonna be interesting. Uh, I gotta play with a mask on, which is gonna be interesting. Um, I'll be wearing heels, so hopefully I don't trip or fall. Um, but yeah, um, see you when I see you. So, I figured, since I'm waiting a little bit, um, I talk about a little bit of me and my degree that I'm going to be getting and doing and yeah, stuff. So, um, I graduated from Valdosta State University on clarinet for music on the education track. It's not an ed education degree, it's just like the education track. Um, basically it sets you up so you can do your um, master's in uh, the um, education. It's uh, called the MAT. It's like a one year program and you can, uh, do that and then you can get your certification and teach um i didn't want to do that so i decided to take a year off and i am now auditioning to do clarinet performance and saxophone performance um currently i'm doing set, uh, clarinet performance um i'm auditioning for that uh, later once i get accepted to wherever i am i'm going to be doing a uh, saxophone performance um but i want to build up my saxophone skills a little bit more because I know I'm not as proficient as I am in clarinet. So um, that's a little bit about what degree I'm going to be doing. Um, basically I'm also auditioning for graduate assistantship. I don't know how I'm going to afford school otherwise. So um, basically I'm going to go to the school that offers me the most money. Um, but yeah, and uh, right now University of New Mexico is kind of already offering me money and stuff so um that might be where i end up but uh we're trying this school too just in case uh something comes up but um yeah so that's a little bit about me hey guys so i am back from maryland f um like two days past <laughs> i i just been chilling and just kind of relaxing um the audition went okay um at least i think um i actually don't know how i did because it kind of felt like i went into a lesson to just kind of present what i have and then i didn't even like play all of my music he just like stopped me and was like here play this here play this and i was just like okay <laughs> like it was seriously like 15 minutes tops like it, it, it almost kind of felt like a waste of time but uh, um i like i said overall i think i did well um i'm not sure how the judge kind of felt about it because he was just like kind of emotionless the entire time didn't show any sort of like you know emotion towards what i what i played so i have no idea so I think I'm going to be accepted, but I'm probably not going to get a graduate assistantship. Uh, also considering they already have one, um, like I already have a student for that. So maybe I'll get a scholarship. I don't know. I guess I'll find out. But, um, but yeah, so New Mexico is Friday. 
I will be doing, you know, that kind of stuff and uh, flying out there. Um, I think this one's going to be a little bit more inviting, a little bit more friendly um, than University of Maryland. Um, not that they weren't like friendly and stuff. It was just like there was kind of nothing to do there. Like they didn't have like a whole day dedicated for like music majors and stuff like that, as opposed to New Mexico, which they have a whole day planned. Like there's a whole schedule they sent me. Um, the professors are really nice and they keep checking in with me and, you know, making sure that everything's going well. And uh, I'm pretty confident about this next audition. Like this one, I don't think I'll be nervous for at all, especially because I already did an audition. So um, yeah, we'll see. But um, yeah, so Friday, uh, I will be probably performing for my parents one last time just to, you know, get it out of the way. Um, I do have some errands to run today and tomorrow, but um, after that, I will be ready to go to New Mexico. So. That's, this should be a really fun trip. I At least I hope so. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I'll see you then. PB, can I make a video? All right, cool. Uh, <laughs> he stopped. <laughs> All right. So, uh, today's the day. Today's my flight. It doesn't leave until like 8.55 p.m., but I'm gonna, we're going to be leaving early just to get to the... Hey, PB! Okay, anyways, <laughs> get to the airport and everything, and uh, so I'm practicing right now, I'm practicing saxophone, um, I'm practicing some uh, etudes and stuff, that, uh, I'm not auditioning on saxophone, but I am going to be having a lesson, so I'm trying to prepare some stuff for a lesson, so, um, but yeah, uh, it's going to be pretty fun, I've never been on a plane, so that's going to be really fun and interesting, um, of course I'm going to be taking video and everything, but, um, yeah, we'll be getting there late tonight, around, like, 10, because of the time change, we'll be, we'll be there around 10, um, and it's a four-hour flight, uh, more like three and a half hours, but, yeah, so, um, that's gonna be really fun, um, and then we get there late tonight, and then tomorrow's my audition, so, uh, I'm really excited, um, because this is, like, my top number one school, basically because they've, they're already offering me money and stuff, but, um, you know, it's just, uh, matter of doing the audition and being formal about it. They they already want me there and I'm pretty confident I'm going to get this um, grad assistantship. I just need to, you know, do my formal audition. Hopefully I don't bomb it. <laughs> I don't think I will because I already did an audition in uh, at University of Maryland and was really, really good. So um, I was pretty confident about it. Um, I do have a sore on my tongue though that is absolutely killing me to tongue. Um, Hopefully it heals overnight and it won't be so bad tomorrow at least. Like today it's not that bad, but I know I'm going to irritate it by tonguing and doing uh, exercises and stuff. So, um, yeah, hopefully, hopefully that goes away. <laughs> um, but yeah, so see you on the flight. So I looked out my window and there's a whole freaking mountain.
Hey guys, so I'm back from Albuquerque. Um, I didn't do too well on this audition, unfortunately. Um, I just, I was there too early. There was a lot of factors that went into it. Like my read was being weird. Um, it was harder to breathe because the elevation. Um, it was just, it was a lot. And I was like super nervous for some reason. And I don't know why. I guess because this one felt just more important to me than uh, the Maryland one. So, um, yeah, I honestly didn't do too well and there was not really much I could do about it. It was just kind of, I just had to, you know, do it. Um, I definitely don't think I got the graduate assistantship. Um, there was, I was listening to a kid after me and he was just like phenomenal. Um, made me jealous and made me upset because <laughs> I was like, darn, I don't get this uh, graduate assistantship. But um, I'm hoping maybe because like my grades were higher and like, you know, I was a really good student that maybe I'll get it. Like maybe they'll just kind of overlook my bad audition and just kind of, you know, be like, okay, well, I, we know she could do better. Cause I also like, I had to send them my senior recital. So I sent them that and um, yeah, hopefully they'll look at that and be like, oh yeah, okay. She, she did a lot better. So um, they also didn't make me play everything uh i did play the entirety of like the first like the four like the three excerpts i had and then the mozart ex exposition but they also didn't make me play the entirety of premiere rhapsody and i kind of wish i did because that was like my best piece so um that was kind of unfortunate for me but yeah unfortunately it's over or yeah there's nothing i can do and go back i can't change anything so I just gotta move on from it and hopefully maybe I'll get something from Maryland because that audition went a lot better um I have no idea whether or not I'm going to get any assistantships or scholarships but we'll see um if not it's not a big deal I can stay here for another year um but you know I really don't want to <laughs> if I could leave I wish I could um I you know I just want to get out of the south I want to get out of Georgia I want to move on and continue with school but um i you know i just i don't want to end up stuck you know i just want to you know like i want to i want to do something with myself you know um <laughs> uh, so yeah so i'm back to my normal life um i will probably make another video uh with my acceptance letters uh i think i'll get in i think i'll definitely get in I just uh, won't get any scholarships, which is kind of hard for me because I kind of need that in order to, you know, afford school. So, um, yeah, thank you guys for watching. So, like, thank you so much. Uh, I know this has been kind of a long video, but I hope you guys enjoyed my little trip. Um, like I said, I'll make another video, you know, showing my acceptance letters or whatever, maybe denial, <laughs> denial letters. I don't know. Maybe we'll see. But I really liked New Mexico. That was a very fun trip. Actually, both trips were really fun. Um, I did like uh, Un University of New Mexico's campus a little bit more. It's a little bit smaller than University of Maryland. Um, but I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what happens. So again, thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you in the next video.